Hey, how you all doing? Welcome to this video leap and photo leap tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to take this vehicle or this subject here in this image, remove the background from the image and replace that background with a different background that you want. So it's recently requested from Alex10 that I show you how to basically remove the background and then um, you can replace it with somebody, something else. So the way, the best or the only way really to do this in, um, in Video Leap is to take the image that you want to remove the background from and actually remove the background in Photo Leap. And there's a function within Video Leap that allows us to do this. So the first thing I want to do is have the image highlighted in my timeline in Video Leap and then scroll along the bottom and you'll see this little um, Photo Leap icon. Press that and this image will now open in Photo Leap. So what that will allow us to do is select the cutout tool and let it just analyze the image for us. And we're gonna um, select the sky because that's essentially what I want to cut out. But I also want to get rid of, if I zoom in, these little bits here. So the way I do that, I'm gonna go to the erase tool at the bottom and I'm just gonna wipe along and start erasing the parts of the image that I don't want to bring into my video composition. So then I'm gonna click the little tick button to apply this. Now, if I went back into um, Video Leap and we look at what's going on here, obviously we would need to move this image drag and drop. So I'm just gonna select it and drag it on top of my um, video timeline to make this image um, have that different background. So we can we could be quite happy with that, but you notice that the image is completely, it's got a completely different feel to what the background has. So I somehow need to match them. And there's a great little tool in Photo Leap that allows us to do that. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take, um, reduce the size of this image. And all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a screenshot of the, um, of the background that I have. And just in my native phone app, I'm gonna adjust the size of that and click done. Just save it to my photos. Now go back to my car image, select the, make sure it's selected, white, um, white border on the other side, go to photo leap. So what that will, this will bring the car image back in. But what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna to go to my layers, click the plus button, um, click import, um, and drag in that screenshot that I've just taken. I'm gonna expand the size of that, just drag it up a little bit on the image, and then drag the car layer above, just so you can see that this is exactly what's going on. Now what I want to do, and I can do this in Photo Leap, is I want to match the colors of both images. I want to harmonize them. So I take the background, press and hold, you get a little haptic tap, drop it onto the car, and I get this little pop-up that says Merge or Harmonize. I'm gonna select Harmonize. And now what I can do, because it's matched the colors of this car to the background colors, I can select the background, drag it down to this little red um, bin down here or trash can, delete that, and I'm left with my image. So now don't click the back button, click the little Video Leap logo. And this will take me back and give me the colors, the harmonized colors to the background. So now when I play through, I've got the image of my car matched to the colors of the So background. yeah, that's how you remove the background and use the harmonize tool in Photo Leap to match the colors of your subject to the background that you wanted to use. Hope this has helped you out. Thanks a lot for requesting that, Alex. And um, I'll catch you all very soon. Take care.